hey guys welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm going to be showing you how i moisturize and style my daughter's hair into bantu knots without using elastic bands as always get comfortable get a drink and enjoy So mamas, as you can probably see from the video, my daughter's hair has changed quite a bit since the last time you saw her. Her texture's changed, her hair has grown in length and also the way I moisturise her hair is slightly different as well. So what I'm doing right now is I'm going to section off her hair. I like to work in sections just so that I'm able to really get to the areas that I want to really well and to just give the product an even spread all around her hair. So right now what you see me doing is adding a leave-in conditioner to her hair. Now bear in mind that I'm working on freshly washed hair. So her hair is damp at the moment. That's why I haven't spritzed any water on her hair and gone straight to the leave-in conditioner. Now the whole method that I'm using right now to moisturize the hair is the LCO method. So the L stands for your liquid, which is your water. As I mentioned, the hair is really damp. And then the C stands for your cream or leave-in conditioner. And then your O is your butter or your oil. I'm using a butter in this case. So as you can see, I'm just applying a little amount of butter to her hair. I'm gonna work that in too. Do you know what's so funny? Because she's now an infant, I have to move really fast when I am doing her hair simply because now she's on the go. She's crawling now and she really doesn't have time to waste. She's a busy little baby, so she, she needs to go places. <laughs> So when I'm doing her hair, she literally wants to go. So I had to move really fast as I was doing this. It was quite difficult to film this um, video for you. But of course, I did it anyway because I love you guys. Okay, so what I'm doing right now is I have divided this section into two sections. I'm plaiting her hair first. Once I get to the ends of the plait, I'm going to twirl it round. And then I'm going to do a bantu knot. Now, bear in mind, with these bantu knots, they don't last for a long time. They last for about two or three days and then the bantu knot comes out. Now for me, I don't mind because I tend to re-moisturize her hair every two or three days anyway. Um, but even though the bantu knot come out, because her hair is now longer, the plaits are actually still in, but the bantu knot may come out. Which again, like I said, is not a big deal for me because I need to re-moisturize her hair anyway every two to three days. Just in case you're wondering, I started plaiting my daughter's hair when she was six months. She was seven months at the time of filming this video. She's now eight months old. But ever since I started plaiting her hair, it's been amazing. One, because she's able to retain more moisture. And then secondly, her hair doesn't tangle as much because her hair is in a protective style. So it works out really, really well for us and just the overall upkeep of her hair. Okay, mama, so I know a lot of you struggle with the LCO method. You don't know what types of products to use. You don't know what order to use your products. And obviously, because your little one's hair is dry, you want a solution that's going to help them retain moisture. So I have put together a guide that simply just explains what the LCO method is and also gives you examples of the types of products to use for the LCO method so you can effectively moisturize your little one's hair so they can retain moisture. If they're retaining moisture, they're going to retain length. So take a look at this guide, download it, click the link below in the description box underneath this video and you can get access to this free guide.
Mamas, don't forget to download your free guide on how to moisturize effectively using the LCO method. So this guide is going to give you an explanation of everything you need to know in order to moisturize effectively using the LCO method, including the right types of products, because that's important, with examples, just so that you can get the LCO method right. So click the link below this video in the description box to get access to your free guide. Six chunky plaits, bantu knots, and that's it. This is the simple way I moisturize my baby's hair and also keep it protected, retaining moisture, and just flourishing, really. Um, I hope this video was helpful. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and share it with anyone you feel may benefit from watching. See you in the next one. Bye.